Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the React Native. So today we are going to learn about the package React Native Camera Roll. So what is the purpose to use the React Native Camera Roll? Okay, so we are going to learn about this in this in this video. So those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, you can like it and share and comment on it. Okay, so let's get started. So what about the React Native Camera Roll? The camera role is a React Native module that provides access to the local camera role or the photo gallery. So whatever you have the gallery in your phone, so you can assess it. So you can sh share it via like a grid form or anything else you can format you like. I will give you the example. I have already uh, do that one. So you can see that one, two, three, four, five images I have added. If uh, currently, if I go and just uh, click some of the images from my phone, let's have a look and see what the images are going to be changed or not. Uh, because in the code, I have just fetched the first five images. If you go and check this one, okay. So here we have the camera roll get first five photographs, right? So we have, uh, I'm just using this one and set that in the images part, okay. So let's uh, click some of the images from the camera. Okay, let me open the camera and click some of the images, right? And let's go uh, for the keypad, right? This big one, one, and this uh, this one of it two. And let's take an example of the mouse. Let's okay, and let's kill this app and open this this one app. Okay, and let's uh, restart this part. So here we go with this one. Okay. So let's go and just run this command and reload this. Let me reload this one. Reload. Why it says I'm not connecting to the cable. Reload. Why it's uh, let me check. Uh, dismiss. Might be I'm not connecting to that part, right? Uh, let me connect to that phone to that part. Give me a second. If I go and just connect it, okay, and uh, just I'm going to allow and just reload this one. So I'm going to reload this, reload. I think there is a net. net issue i guess uh, arising over here let me confirm this one just give me a second okay meanwhile we can just uh, read the code so here we go with that one right so let's have a look on that okay so here is the react and the component from the react so this is the permissions that required for this one right uh, this import this is very important permissions if I go and just kill this app Okay, close all this app I'm just closing all the, my app right closing and just uninstalling this build Just give me a second uninstalling this build uh, remove this build. Okay, so build I have removed that that one So let's go to terminal and install the build again Okay, so let me run this command it says uh, emulator issue. Just give me a second. Let me create the build first. So transfer build allow run. So I think build is done. Now build is done. Let's have a look on that. Okay. So you can come to know about that in the previous things we have 
the previous one you can see that first image i have taken this one that one this one that one so first five images that come across over here uh, by the help of this one okay you can see that so here we have the first five photos camera roll function camera roll get photos so whatever photos that you want to get you can get that part and after that i have just get the asset dot not dot image the mapping that one and uh, low uh, save all the images in that state you can see that here all the images are set into that state and in the component it mount you need to uh, add the permissions without uh, the storage or the permissions you can't get access to that part right so you need to uh, get the permissions of the like writing the assessments uh, you are going to allow to assess the gallery or not so you need to write the permissions over here right so this is the camera roll function that is react native camera roll and this is the way that we can get the photos from camera roll dot get photos and uh, you can set what, whatever you can perform the action you can perform the action and here we on the behalf of the images what we have set in the state we are just using the map function that may iterate or loop through it and just showing that all the part in the image area with their uri so you can see that in the console part here i have already logged that part so you can see that this is the uri that i have added this is the url this is the url i have added this is the url this all the urls that i have added and it shows to that part right one two three four five five images five things right you can see that so this is this is the functionality that uh, the react native camera all, uh, is all about is basically a react native module that provides access to the local camera a role or a photo library so this if you if i have some requirement like if you want to fetch first 10 images or something like this then you can use this uh, uh, this camera role right suppose we have the array of, of images and you want to row a uh, row into a like a beautiful gallery you want to make you can also make that part okay so this is how we can use the react native camera role in the react native so any doubt any query in that just let me know in the comment section and any doubt in the in the code part also you can just let me know about that okay and one thing which i have missed is that one that i haven't updated the permission uh, like android manifest.xml also so for that one you need to go with the android manifest here you need to add the permissions which i forget to remember this this permissions you need to add read images read media video and the right external storage you need to add this part right after adding this part you need to go with the build.gradle you need to add this one implementation project react native camera role implementation project okay don't forget this build gradle so it should be react native uh, your application name there should be a app build.gradle it should be android app build.gradle you need to add this part right after that settings.gradle uh, settings.gradle is resides in the android settings.gradle so here we need to add this to fun uh, include that project that is this one let me uh, indent it word wrap so it is this one a camera role and the project directory camera role so this needs to be added then after that main application.java so it resides in the main java com toast main application.java right so here we need to I import the package over here. So here I have I import the package and also add the new camera roll package over here. After adding all this functionality, after adding all the code in the app.js file, then you need to create the build. And don't forget to add this uh, npm package also. That is, we are using React Native camera roll, right? So this package you need to install. So what is the package to install this one? So you need to install npm install react native camera role and save this one. Okay. This is the package that we have to install after installing this, create the build, run this, um, meteor.js, uh, this server. And after doing this, you will get the output of this one. You will get the first five image from the local, uh, library and you can show it over here. So any doubt, any query in that, just let me know in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching this video. Have a great day. I will see you in the coming week, uh, next video. Let's see what I'm going to uh, show on the next video. So be, be with me. Okay. Thank you so much. Have a great day.